Hello, my friend, and welcome, or oh, welcome back. I'm Mr. Bakanudu, and this is called Hero Slayer. Let's see what the game has for us today. We're playing Random Random. Okay, Alchemist and Clown. Clown? Is it the one that becomes... This is not the... This looks like a stun run, but let's start with the, the basics and jump right in. If you're watching this in 2024, well, happy new year. Anyway, let's jump right in and just have some fun. Just because we started the run with them randomly, doesn't mean that the run is going to end up with only these two characters specifically. We might change them later, if we find something better, something more powerful. Or something free, because free upgrades are very important. Um, from my latest experiences, it's getting harder and harder to actually evolve everything on the Arachnid Shrines, unless you have 4 treasure. But at the same time, treasure might be the best inscription in the game now for the Act 6. And the most powerful one doesn't necessarily mean that... Well, uh, it. I don't want it to become overly dependent on something that will probably get nerfed for being too powerful. That's my excuse. To not want to play with the most powerful thing in the game. But doesn't mean that we cannot win without it. Can also just grab piety, right? Piety revenge win the game. Which might also be overly reliant in, re being overly reliant in something that we can't so we can't get better in the game. I don't know. Let me know. Am I a bad player for trying to play with good strategies? Maybe. I mean, I'm a bad player, but at least I win sometimes. Well, I think I started wrong by habits. Just started with the Carlion staff, but we do have the mod installed for custom items. If you don't know, uh, I have one that I developed uh, together with Hexa. That has this item here, Carlin's flag, and this one would give us more damage overall for the early game, which is very good. Also, interesting could be forcing this into a overrun run, spirits of Christmas past or something. But let's uh, oh, punished. I'm taking this. You know what? And see if we can do the make this an overrun run. Run, run, run. At the same time, I do want to destroy this. Not because it's bad, but because we can fix treasure. And fixing treasure is very important. So let's see. Our stats right now, 275% magic. Not awful. And we have slime, which is another one of those high wing buttons in the game. Because you can't die if you are invincible and you are and you have items that are dealing damage for you. So it might be a good way of finishing the, the year or starting the next one. With a bang. Again, not forcing anything, not forcing any strategy, just going with the flow. Let's see how this goes. I missed. <laughs> okay, that was lower than I was expecting, but maybe no, no legendary. Okay, I will keep going. 
we've done a rider recently, so there's another rider run. Do this. Okay. Boom. More commons. <laughs> Started opening and This NPC here. I think we're okay with these skills, so not the best, but it's fine. I see something nice here. I'm not doing physical alchemist, right? No, I'm not doing physical alchemist. That's a nice one. Stun! No. Okay. Open this. I'll destroy that. Could take a second wisdom. Second wisdom is useful. Could fix fairy tale already, but I think it's too early. Let's just keep going. I have gotten the invisible knife, probably. Hunter, no. Very good hunter in general, but no. Roll and mystery, sure. Now it looks like we are doing actual damage, which is nice. Boom. And now Alchemist is doing more damage with his basic attack than the speed skull. Which is ridiculous, because if you don't know, Alchemist cannot deal damage. Oh, can, can I increase attack speed? But anyway, this was a fairly slow Act 1, but we should be fine now. Grasir should be a manageable boss. This is... <laughs> this is looking so far like the Hexa build that he calls the beam projectiles, which I've never never done in this... Never done in this channel, so maybe? Maybe this is a projectile run for fun?
I should be using my invisibility button, huh? Anyway. I should be doing a lot of things. But not really. Let's see. This item. Very, very, very good if you're doing uh, Disney stuff. We do have one Disney already on the Neurolapsis flask, but I don't think that's enough. The rest is sad though. Can we? It's fine, just get rid of the expensive item and hope we see something better next time. Aging. Aging is nice for skill spam style. But honestly, I just want weakness exposure because we are doing rapidity stuff right now and collection desire. We will see more as we go. Um, specifically, stuff that will be very good. Mm, what's the name of that thing again? Oh, go get her. Yeah. So, so far, so good. Let's keep grabbing these so we can actually evolve our skulls. They I will remember to use slime. Trust me. <laughs> Legendary? Oh. Uh, champion. This is not a champion run, right? Right? Unless... I don't like those skills. Give me combo. Also, I've done a mage rapidity run recently, right? So, we don't want you to do rapidity, pure rapi rapidity runs. Yeah, that's an upgrade. That's nice. Okay, that's an upgrade for this. This is pure. This is... We could argue just get rid of these and go for treasure and nah these two though we might pivot now these two are very 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 absurd together and we do have slime so let's see uh we can get rid of these can get rid of this. We will need over a thousand gold. So let's do some math. Nah, let's not. Let's start just destroying stuff until we have enough. I'm okay with this uh, with losing one item. Oh, this one should have gone first. Oops, my bad. Anyway, we'll find more items ahead of us. But now, we do have... Um, oh, for wisdom. Okay then, this is a magic clown run. Or of course, uh, an alchemist run. Or... I... Slime is absurd. Slime. <laughs> slime with these items is so ridiculous. I will take the item room just so we can have full item set, but we do need to take all the fragments that we can, especially if we are still going to try to do two legendaries. Treasure.
Okay. This is defense and brawl. I don't think we're doing an elementalist staff run. Too soon for me. I I lost to Dark Hero with a run. With two of them. Ninja became invincible for two seconds. Now he became dead. Okay then. No legendary? Okay, that's fine. Tell mace, it's fine. No. Will be fun though. Skill spam bomber. Fireworks for the new year. No, let's not do force thematic anything. It's fine that we have these. If we do find a legendary, we still can replace it, so it's still fine. Also, I hate this. Again, now with Kaboom. No, don't tempt me again. Okay, let's see what we get. Hmm, is this a bone run? We haven't done bone yet, and this is a good bone item. Okay, no, not this bone. But yeah, this might be the bone, the bone day. Treasure, revenge is nice. No, this looks like a bone, but it's not a bone, it's a scabbard. What is a scabbard? I have no idea. Heirloom, rapidity, mystery, artifact, fortress. Let's do artifact since we are doing magic damage mostly and keep going. Prophet spoils him in a cycle. No, in a cycle is good. It's prof uh, spoils. This is the elite. So let's do the. And yeah, we're done with deck 2, nice. It's a... Uh, our damage is fine. I wish we had found the... Fortune Dawn and stuff like that, but it's fine. We will evolve as things go. First, let's kill some sisters. Hello. Oh no, I took damage.
Okay. One is dead. By the way, if you don't know, you can actually stun this and escape the phase of the slashes. Though it doesn't help much because everything is harder than the slashes. So. Yeah, I didn't have the slime there. Maybe we want heritage to guarantee that slime doesn't treat us in such a situation. But so far, so good. Let's see what our reward is. Okay. So in Ezio, not better than slime. You heard. Not here first. I believe probably other people have told you that. It's too good. This is a nice one, overall. Manatech is a nice inscription. Are you getting rid of Brawl? I don't know, don't think so. Maybe. I don't, I'm not ready to get rid of Treasure. Al alternatively... If we're going Bone... We're not going for mana cycle, right? Though for mana cycle is very good because it's basically another bone of mana. For mana cycle with slime sounds funnier. So let's get rid of brawl. It's fine. Hopefully. Let's see. Let's see what we're getting. Life change, heads or tails. No and no. Life change is actually very good if you're doing Mercury Heart as well. However, I think we want to start. Go get her. Maybe we even want predicted pain as well. Don't know yet. But let's take it, otherwise we can just re remove it if we find something better. It's still not enough to go legendary with, with any of our skulls. So let's try to fix that. I opened that chest? No idea. Don't remember. Does it matter? Probably not. This is the most interesting elite choice in the game <laughs> because it's just hard to hit. See, <laughs> it's not that it's hard to deal with in general. It's okay, it's okay. Let's see if we're. That's a nice one, but we're not doing that much physical anyway. Uh, drugs, as always, good. I'll take the HP, HP doesn't hurt, we might even take the HP up there. Artifact and treasure, hmm. If we take this we can replace both, yeah we can replace both here. So bang for your, your buck, this gets out. Let's replace first artifact with Heirloom, yeah. Heirloom is a nice one. 
Yeah, we keep going. This increases our collection desire, which is nice. This got slower now without without the brawl, dealing extra hits. But it's fine, because, well, you'll see. If you're new to this. Out the this event is fine. Oh, there was even a goal in there. Okay, then some gold. Thanks. Let's fight some adventures. Not yet. Okay, we will get a legendary though, which is nice. by her loom there. Nice. I'm saving the golden for the adventures. Which are right here. Right now. For fun. Neighbors, you're legendary. Not you, guy. The women. I'll take both. <laughs> A lot of stuff going on screen, and that makes me scared. Wait. Oh, I thought she was invincible for a moment. That would have been risky. Oh. Mm. No legendaries. Okay. Let's see. 11 fragments. Also, not great. Let's. Start with Clown. Clown is a uh, is a nice one for multi hitting. All I want is invisible knife back. Paladin, not a bad one. No. Okay, maybe. We are almost at full HP, right? So. Nice. We can do. We can cheese this with slime. Cool. Got stuck? <laughs> oh, because I wasn't jumping. I don't do this often. Can you tell? Okay, we took some hits and it's fine. We got a fast travel. And. Some gold. Oh, this is a very, 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 very absurd, very good item. But also apparently very unpopular, unpopular because no one wanted to see my video on it. I had two of them. Two. Anyway, uh, is it too late for this? I don't know. It is very good though. Screw this. We still have treasure fixed, so. No harm, no foul, right? This is her and Wisdom. 
we can have her long here if we replace this this would be 30 from chimera 30 from joanne 30 from hero 30 from yeah that's that's good as we lose concentration speed i guess but that doesn't matter really i will heal though i'm a bit covered here and let's keep going at some point we will get rid of treasure treasure is not a major building block for our build here it's just value so it's fine tried opening that in time that that wasn't necessary at all but we're in like three we are not going to die it's fine good item fine item um nah let's get this why don't you legendary if we can Okay, Frieza came to us, but there's an NPC up there, minimap shows it, so let's see if it is slime, it's not slime, but what do you have for us? No. Ninety-three fragments, okay it's fine, let's find the easiest boss in the game. pause for hydration because it's important kids I like that they're taking this much damage, really. To this boss. Okay, maybe we're just making noise and not doing good damage, huh? This needs to change. How much percent? 500. Maybe that's not enough. Even though we do have 4 wisdom, right? And for mana cycle, and predicted wins, so our skill damage should be insane, but well. Let's just keep going, instead of complaining. Heirloom mystery. Mana attack, best fortune. No, nothing here really, so... See here. No. Man Man Scream. No. Pretty good pain and keep going. Now it needs to get our legendary alchemist, so we keep going. It's fine, it's fine. It's fine, right? Right? I hope so, because I'm scared. Maybe this demon Omicom is not going to transform and we're just going to cry. So let's see. So ideally we don't want to... to kill everything with our basic attack. I, I don't think I'm going to min max this Demonomicon. It's not going to transform easily because our items are dealing a lot of damage. And it's not fun. Let's let's see if we find a better replacement. 
I don't want this only for these inscriptions. Could have been the one. Could have been the one. Too late now. With all crit items, clown deals zero damage, huh? Okay then. That's interesting. Anyway. I don't please give us a part of greed or another mental suppressor. Or I don't know. I don't think we could take the Raven's Medallion here. Maybe we could. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see what, what this holds for us because I still don't know. This is a questionable run from a questionable day. Legendary? Oh, okay. We called Le Netherman Suppressor and we got Netherman Suppressor. So now we can get rid of. Oh, wisdom 2, 3, 4. We could get rid of this. Yeah. Let's get rid of this. We're not doing basic attack anymore. For now. This is Mana Cycle and Treasure. It would be a way to hold for Treasure. For longer this right now might be too late for it there are three or four adventures that we wouldn't take the item at any cost so maybe not probably not this is a very good item fortress and revenge and damage reduction hmm the more I look at it the more I feel like it would be good. Maybe now we get rid of treasure and do this. Revenge, as I said, very good, right? And we need some help. So let's see. Let's see if this helps us. Let's fix revenge here. Right now it doesn't do anything. Just occupies a slot there for safety, but it should be fine. Also, we can replace the heirloom with I guess fortress or we fix we can fix uh, one of these like we can fix mana cycle and get rid of the book and take this as a bet let's let's try that I will replace heirloom still with mana cycle we want four mana cycles still take this and keep moving there was a There was a bit of pivoting, there. there was a bit of pivoting there, in our strategy. But, if our goal is to fight Dark Skull, this should be it. Otherwise, we can always just skip Dark Skull and have an okay video for New Year. New Year, new card. But that's not my goal, for now. Let's evaluate when we get there. The damage is still low, even though we do have now that our mana suppressor, right? So, 166. This shouldn't be low. This is just because we skipped the damn uh, invisible knife and never saw it again, huh? And, and we. St uh, slime! Okay. I'm already thinking here. We will have to get rid of the... The good stuff right before... Mm. 
No. Okay, so. These two items are mediocre, really. For this run. But we, we kind of want to keep both. Because of mana cycle. This item here. It's very risky. Because it's a bet. If we go there to this adventure fight. And it's the mage. Or the the archer we have two of them two of the legendary which would go with, would be insane on the other hand let's see let's not make spe speculations let's see the the item first what is the item okay it's just artifact to wisdom so no, right? No. It's it's okay, but it's okay stats. But no. Let's just see here. Yeah. This is one of the adventures that we don't want the legendary, so a waste of an item. But it's fine. Got shredded there, huh? You see the revenge? Okay, our damage is atrocious. Also, did we just heal for one? We took 60 damage. Yeah, yeah. I don't want either, really. That was really, really, really awful. That's a. It's not a good sign for this run, really. Uh, we should be doing way more than this. An X4 adventure should be easy at this point. Not at this point in the in the run. Because the Act 4 adventure is always in the same point in the run. But at this point in my run building, essentially. Okay, I'm going to take this item and we are going to take to find Fortune Dawn to help us with our damage. And by our damage I mean to do some more extra damage. Because we need that. Absolutely needed. Holy crap, that's bad. I don't know if it's better to get HP, damage, or crit from this guy here. It doesn't matter because we're going to take to get attack speed. But let's see. What is your okay? Or damage? You can only get there that that specific thing if you actually run I forgot uh, if you have the the mod 
fix NPC RNG because well the devs are insisting saying that there's no issue there yeah, though I've I hope I demonstrated well and everyone's experience also observed this kind of stuff let's see legendary this would have been a very 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 good um, Run, huh? That's sad. That's what you get for pivoting. Hindsight and regret. I do want to see more items. We need more items. That's so sad. ridiculously sad. I have no idea. Also, I have no idea if the Demonomicon would have transformed at this pace. But too late. Too late. Talking about very, very late. Well, we're in the end. We it's time for the boss gauntlet. Meaning scared, I'm scared. We don't have enough fragments for anything, really. We don't have good damage, even though our stats are fine. We go over a thousand as soon as we enable um with wisdom. We don't have anything else. And the anything else is kind of important. So let's Go here, go through this, turn this on. I don't think slime can carry us here. this and stun her here she will not clash the balls she will skip to the next uh, phase this doesn't matter for us because of course it's Joanne right but just as a nice cool exploit that you can technically use Okay then. Very okay then. Very good if we had the uh, descriptions. It might still be, be better than the solar sword that, that is here just because we have no hope, right? Yeah. It's sad to do this without the inscriptions. Inscriptions are very, very, very powerful. But no. So let's... Let's go. Let's see what we find here. Bone shield. As I said, we don't have enough. I will take predicted pain out and do the test. Piety. Can piety carry us with a single revenge here, even though our run is not the most absurd thing ever? That's the ultimate test, right? So I'm going to take a four hits here of attack speed, specifically skill cooldown speed, 
it's not that much but we don't have many items giving us skill cooldown speed so kind of important if we're doing a skill spam build let's wipe here just try seeing everything that we cannot afford and keep going Boom. Nice, nice. Taking any win that we can get, right? We took more than 30 seconds in this room here. Not a good sign. Not a good sign at all. But this here is where I show the final build of the run. Uh, of, yeah, the final build. So, Joker, the Alchemist, just stuff that we got from the beginning in the random picker. Slime, the best thing for this run. We do have Stone of the Hair, which is not a lot, but it's here. Bone of Mana, Nether Mana Suppressor, Ritual Staff. In, the, in a vacuum, very good stuff, but we just have Mage's Necklace and Bone of Mana dealing damage. Master Fighter is here because we couldn't find something better, which is sad. Uh, bone of Time because I was trying, maybe I will do Bone, but no. It's uh, no. Nice Determination is here for Revenge, I guess. We're testing whether Revenge plus Piety is going to save this run because... So far, with these stats, even though the numbers seem fine, Clown is a very crit-focused uh, skill, uh, crit, uh, crit-focused skull, and his skills deal very low damage if you don't have something like Invisible Knife. But anyway, uh, Collection Desire, Go Gather, Weakness Exposure, okay, good stuff. Let's jump, just jump out here and see how this goes. I'll see you in the other end. And as always, if you reached this far into the video, have yet to subscribe, please consider doing so. I really appreciate your support. My goal for 2024 is... I don't know. 2024... Subscribers? I have no idea. Just kidding. I... Oh. I was going to enable the golem and did that instead. Nice. Piety doing its thing, which is nice. It's not specifically Piety, it's revenge, but Piety makes it so it's positive. Ouch. I reacted very, very late with the slime there, but it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, the hero. I'll be honest with you, I haven't lost even reassembly to the hero in a while. I think that the Dark Mirror 10, it's fine, it's balanced, it's... we're doing... I'm very used to it. But I don't... I, I haven't played enough of the ending to actually be comfortable doing the destruction that is necessary for it. Which is sad, because... I did have at least some potential to be a top player in this game for the YouTube game uh, for the for the YouTube uh, for the English speaking YouTube. I'm not uh, talking about the <laughs> the Koreans because them th those Koreans are put us to shame. If only I had a freaking invisibility button. Huh? So yeah, taking damage here to the hero. Not very hopeful.
Okay. Jump, jump, dash, dash. Stay. Jump, jump, dash, dash. Stay. Free. As I said, we we did take some hits hit there and would have lost reassembly if we hadn't have piety, I guess, a revenge, but it's fine. So yeah, I I think I'm not going to do the voice is cracking. Wait a second. I think that we will not play specifically the Dark Hero today. I just want to get this video out. And as you've seen, we invested a lot, a lot of time together. So let's jump into the cannon, get our mana cycle upgraded, see what it does. Leave a bone for a next opportunity very soon. And uh, mana cycle. I'll, I'll show bone. Bone is essentially evolves every single bone item that you have. That's nice. Mana cycle. Well, creates a mana cycle. Hmm. What is this mana cycle? That's, it's basically another bone of mana, but it's le it lasts a long time. See? And it deals some damage. So let's jump here. Skip the, the thing because we are cowards. And just get this win. And the ear with a note. Not very high, but with a note. That's that's positive at least. Hello, Mr. Alexander. I'm going to try to see if we can skip any of the first attack by using our stun thing. It's too fast. Let's do the mana cycle thing. So yeah, the fact that this is taking this long, I'm not used to it, to be honest. Maybe that, that's my problem, I didn't learn how to evade the, 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 the bosses because I always am so powerful. Who knows? That means I'm a good run builder. Or lucky, dude. Who knows? Oh no, the cage. Oh no, the cage. He's dead. Anyway, the trick. You go to this room and think it's the same one, but then they clear all of your stuff. Meaning, they transition into another room. And didn't transition your summons and your mana attacks. Mana attacks are nice. We heal for more than we take the took damage there. I think so. She's beautiful. Thank you, Fairy. I have no idea how much damage we took there because I wasn't paying attention. But I assume it was a lot.
But uh, then we immediately healed, so thank you, Piety, again. Part when you get hit multiple times. And yes, this run would have died to Dark Skull easily. <laughs> Especially since I have no idea what's going on on screen. Going, thank you. Let's start by doing the slime thing. No, we got stuck. We really got stuck there in the swap from Clown. Couldn't move until we could swap again. <laughs> dangerous. Very dangerous. We almost died. We're going to die here. Uh, losing reassembly to Alexander. Means that we had no freaking chance of killing the Dark Skull. But yeah, we cleared this phase. The next one should be easier. Not very easy, but easier. Which is a good sign. I've been scared, I guess. But yeah, Mana Cycle, have no idea how much it contributed. Everything still feels slow. Which is weird. This run, on paper, is good. Wait, what? I don't care about evading this. Let's kill. Slime? Do the thing? Yay. Not scared at all. That is was... Well... Of all the runs that I've done at Skull the Heroes Leader and posted on my YouTube channel, this is certainly one of them. So, I'm glad that you've been here. Give yourself a pat on the back for suffering with me throughout all of this. Anyway, I've been Mr. Baconudo. This has been Skull the Heroes Clear. I'll see you in the next video. But until then, as always, stay safe. And a happy new year.